What's up guys? Coming back to y'all again today with another Dollar Tree haul. What? 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 Another Dollar Tree haul? Didn't we just get a Dollar Tree haul? Yes, we did. But, because Timu ignited an idea in me, I needed to go to a do another Dollar Tree um, in Gastonia and look for some containers to put smaller things that are on the shelf that y'all see at home <laughs> that y'all usually see in my background at home that has like the funky carton on it well that's where we keep extra food items because we don't have very much of an actual pantry so i was scrolling through timu earlier and um almost took took Timo up on this offer but because I'm tired of spending money I decided to back out of it but it did ignite a certain thing in me that after I saw some storage baskets it was like a it was like a 10 pack of storage baskets um not really like baskets but like the plastic containers <laughs> yes ma'am If I give you one, one sip of it, are you going to be good and drink your orange drink? Probably not going to be very good. I got, we stopped at um, Krispy Kreme and got a couple of donuts and I got an iced coffee. But then I stopped literally right next door at McDonald's and got her a orange high C. But she wants a sip of my iced coffee, so one, one little sip of it. But yeah, Timu kind of ignited this need to oh i could get some storage baskets and put some of these like boxed dinners and stuff like that in on my in my pantry so i knew the perfect place to go because there's a particular dollar tree that has like a whole like wall of storage bas storage baskets and stuff okay can i have my drink my, can i have my coffee back now Wait. no we're not playing in the Okay, let me get my coffee. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you like your iced coffee? Yeah, I do like it. That's why I want to drink it. But, so I went to this Dollar Tree and to see what they had. I kind of, I, I had a little bit of trouble figuring out which ones to get, but I did kind of settle on a couple of them. And I'll show you what I got. But of course, I can't just go in there for one thing. So... After that, I kind of headed to the food side. I didn't check anything else on the general merchandise side. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't check anything else on the general merchandise side, but I did decide to um, head to the food side and uh, see what they have because I was kind of hoping that they would have like pasta sauce and some. Um, I really wanted angel hair pasta. They did have some spaghetti and thin spaghetti, but I really wanted angel hair pasta. And sadly, no pasta sauce. So that doesn't mean I didn't come out with a bunch of stuff. So let me show y'all what I did get. And there's a couple people coming out in the car right over here next to me. So give me a second. Yeah, um, while I'm waiting for them to leave. Yeah, we're we're sitting in front of a store now, and we're going to go in here in a minute. And it's a store called Pop Shelf, and I didn't know we had one down this way. Uh, somebody mentioned it in a video, and I think it was Aaron, or somebody that had recently gone into a Pop Shelf. I'm pretty sure it was Aaron. Um, and I'd never, never heard of it. I think I had kind of heard it in passing, but I didn't know we had one down this way. But when we went to coming into this shopping center to go to the Dollar Tree, um, I noticed a sign on the main big uh, shopping center sign that said that said Pop Shelf. Yeah, they do. And um, so I was like, I didn't know there was a Pop Shelf down this way. So we're going to go in there in a minute and check it out. And uh, see, it kind of looks like from the outside, I can kind of see 
on the inside of it. It kind of does look a little bit like a five below mixed with like Claire's. So we're gonna see what's in there. It's probably for like the, uh, the 20 somethings. But it doesn't hurt to go into a new store and check and see what it's about. So we're gonna do that, but let me show you what we got at the dollar store first. So where do we begin? Um, I'll, I'll show you the storage baskets that I got. Um, I did settle on these. I got three of them. I wanted the clear ones, but they only had one clear one. And so I got two, one clear and two gray. Um, and these are great for, you just put them on the shelf. And then if you need to take something out, so you put it on the shelf and you take some of that, you just pull it out, pull out maybe whatever it might be in the back or whatever you need. And then you can just slide it back in. So I got three of those. And then while we were heading toward the food side, um, I happened to notice these on an aisle as I was passing them. And it is the pre-cut parchment paper, um, 25 count, yeah. I don't know if it says how big each sheet is. Um, maybe 10 inches by 10.7 inches by 13.6 inches each. That's what it says at the bottom. Hold on, honey. Um, I'm thinking that's what it is, because it doesn't really say how big the sheets are. But I'm thinking that's what the, I'm thinking that's what it is. Um, there. But I'm, I thought I would try these out and see if I like them, because anytime I make biscuits or you know heat up, um, well heat up frozen biscuits or frozen French fries or whatever in the oven on a baking sheet, I always use parchment paper underneath it to kind of save some cleanup. And I saw these and I thought I would try them out and see how I like them, see if they make um, things any easier. And then, I got a lot of food y'all, so I am kind of gonna save that. I did get this with the intention of drinking it, but because I put it in the bag, I forgot about it until I was going through these Krispy Kreme drive through But it's all good. I'll drink it later. Hold on. Let me get... I'm about to get it out now. So, luckily, this Dollar Tree did have some face masks. Um, and so I got several. I got... I got what I could. I think this is all. Hoping this is all of them. I think this is all of them. So first we have a cocoa and shea butter treatment mask. Cocoa and, and shea butter. Then we have, um, they had a couple of these Be Pure um, soda pop uh, sheet masks. I got a grape soda one, which is, it says hyaluron, grape extract and hyaluronic acid. Um, and this one is a cherry soda pop with cherry extract and hyaluronic acid. And then they had some of these real veggie farm ones. Um, I got, <laughs> this is double shot, double shot mask. Um, so we got a double shot mask, an avocado mask, avocado one. Then we have a carrot one. And then finally an olive mask. So I got some masks for y'all. I was actually thinking today I may pre-record a mask Monday, but we'll see. Y'all will find out come Monday. <laughs> and I did get this little mini lip gloss um, for Abby, just to, cause she's always like trying to get into my lip glosses and stuff. So I just picked this one up for her. It was either this or I think cherry. And she likes the watermelon apparently. She was all about the watermelon stuff today. So I'm going to pick that out and give that to her so just a cute little I like how it is um in the oh this is like a little mini lip gloss isn't it I thought this was the kind like you do like that but this is like a little mini lip gloss like you do that can and I, it's thick can I, do it now? I don't think you need this kind honey I'll get you your little sponge thing in a minute but it's thick I didn't know it was that kind <laughs> sorry but other than that, it is cute. Like I said, they had this, and then they had a cherry one. 
So let me find your sponges somewhere. Put that back in there. I'm gonna try to keep this cleaned up as much as I can. So less to put up later. Because after I get done with this haul, I'm gonna put these stuff in the trunk. And then next, um, there it is. Is that it? I feel like I'm missing something. I really do. I feel like I'm missing the cup. Because there was a cup we picked out. Oh, well, we'll see. Um, so I guess we're going to go ahead and get into the food because I don't see the cup that she picked out. Oh, there it is. It fell out. Never mind. <laughs> we went in and, and they had these little cups right here. They had this one. They had one that was like, um, had purple, um, with, and then like white ghosts. And then they had one that was, had orange design on it with, um, happy Halloween and some pumpkins. Um, and then there were like stars all over the rest of the cup. She almost got that one, but then I, I showed this one to her and she said she wanted this one, but they're so cute. It's little spiders on it, but I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Um, it lights up, but obviously we're out in the bright lights of the daytime, so you're not going to be able to see it, um, but it lights up. So I just thought this was really cute. I went ahead and got this for Abby or me, whoever wants to use it. So, there. so let's get into the food stuff. Wait a minute. Might be something else. Hold on, we got one more thing. Um, and I'm going to give her these, even though I don't know why she picked them out. Um, it's a watermelon shape makeup sponge. And she had picked up these. And there was an orange one. And then I think a lemon one. And I told her... You don't need makeup sponges, but I'll get you one. So, I just went ahead and picked her that up. So, you want your, your watermelon? Okay. <laughs> so, let me give her this real quick. <laughs> we... She just wants to play with the sponges, so. She doesn't know what they're for. There. Anywho, so that's it. Um, the rest is food. <laughs> so, picked up a bag of the fluffy, fluffy stuff, cotton candy. Um, I think there's three different flavors in here. Strawberry, blue raspberry, and lemon. Um, fun fact, blue raspberry is a man-made, man-made flavor. Once you know, you're never going to forget it. And I also picked up two cans of the beef chili with beans. Um, I do like this with, um, saltine crackers, like, uh, mashed up, broken up, and put into it. It's really good. Kind of does rival a little bit the Wendy's chili. It's not exactly just like the Wendy's chili, but if you put crackers in it, it's like a close second. It's, it's, it's right there, under, right there underneath it. It's really good. And then, of course, I had to pick up some, co some of the coffee lattes. Um, they had the caramel ones in these that the other one didn't have the other day. And there was four of them on the shelf. So I did pick up a four. I did pick up all four. I picked up all four. Sorry. Picked up all four. And I'm not going to show y'all all four, but got four of them. And then because they had some other flavors in addition to that. Where's the other ones? And they also had a couple other flavors that I have never seen. Um, I picked up two of the Twix, Twix flavor. Um, Twix made with Victor Allen's because Twix is chocolate and caramel and maybe a little bit of that kind of graham cracker cookie stuff. So I'm pretty sure this is, this is probably pretty good. I think I've actually had this like in a bottled version, like this kind of bottled version that I got from Food Lion a while back. If this is the same stuff, it should be pretty good. Either way, it should be pretty good. So Twix. And then, they also had a Briar's Cookies and Cream iced coffee. 
So a cookies and cream flavored iced coffee. So we're gonna give that a try too. I think I thought that sounded really good. Um, and I do occasionally like these sparkling ice caffeine. These actually do have sweetening in them. So I picked up two cans of that of this. Um, I picked up one of the watermelon lemonade, and then one can of the black raspberry. They did have blue raspberry too, but I'm not I'm not all about the blue raspberry. Um, but I did like the idea of the black raspberry though. So I'm gonna put some of these in here, and then I'm gonna put my other coffee in there. I gotta get some of this stuff out of the way. <laughs> it's just too much, y'all. It's too much. And I think that's all of that one. Yeah. I also found some um, TGI, TGI Friday's Crinkle Fries Corn Snacks in the Chili Cheese Flavor. I figured I thought those sounded pretty good. So me and Abby are gonna try those out here later. Not right now. We're high on donut sugar. Well, I am. <laughs> um, and then we also got, um, I got these little two packs of uh, like vegetables. We got the sweet corn. I got a diced carrot. And they also had a uh, mixed vegetable. It has the corn, um, corn, carrot, peas, and potatoes in it. So I, I kind of like being able to give her some of this, just like open up these little microwavable ones to put with some, like when I give her chicken nuggets or something, um, just to kind of give her some vegetables in there somewhere. So that's those. And then the last bag is like stuff from the frozen section. Um, we got some, I got a, one of the Michelinas and the cheese pizza. I actually do like these a little bit better than this other kind that I got. Um, because these are a little bit better if, when you microwave them. But I got one of the cheese pizza and I got a Celeste brand sausage and pepperoni and a deluxe pizzas. Um, this is just another option for either something to fix her when she's hungry or me or Andy if, if we just want something. Um, and then they had, they had these like um, Snaps brand snacks. We got a Snaps brand loaded potatoes, loaded potato sticks. Real baked potato, cheddar cheese, sour cream, and flavored with bacon in a crispy golden coating. If these aren't soggy, they sound really good. Um, and they had the mac and cheese bites as well. So I picked up those. They also did have like, um, what was the other ones they had? They had mozzarella sticks and a like cheese and pepper um, kind of bite. Um, no, thank you. <laughs> and then lastly, I got some of these chicken pot stickers because I have never had a pot sticker. And a lady that I watch on YouTube, she loves, absolutely loves pot stickers. And when she said, you know, the, ex basically what they are, I'm like, why wouldn't I like a pot sticker? So I'm going to try them and see if I like them. Um, it said you can microwave them for a minute and 25 seconds. But I'm going to try a chicken pot sticker. They did have pork ones too, but um, I feel like a chicken would be a better option to go with for somebody that's never had a pot sticker. So, but that's going to do it for the Dollar Tree haul. Um, I'm going to go in here. We're going to go in here to Pop Shelf and uh, see what they're about. And if I get anything, then I will show you guys at a later time. Um, maybe I can throw it in with a Timu haul or something. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for today. Abby, you want to say bye? Bye. <laughs> we'll talk to y'all later, guys. I hope you saw something in this video that you liked. If you did, please don't hesitate to give me a thumbs up. And let me know in, your, in the comments what your favorite thing was down below. And don't forget, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know when I upload new videos. 
And if you are a returning viewer, please make sure that uh, you're still subscribed because YouTube likes to randomly unsubscribe people just because they feel like it. Just because they have nothing better to do. Either that or their system is really, really screwed up. So, I'm going to let y'all go. I'll see you guys again real soon. And until then, be good guys. Bye for now. Bye.